I got all day. What's it gonna be? I'm a thief. Confess! 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 Everything we do on my show, we, 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 we steal from the Richard Bay show. That's all right, Jerry. Don't worry. They all do it. Ricky, Sally, even Geraldo. Hey, gang, you know me. I'm the only guy in daytime who has higher ratings than Richard Bay. <laughs> it's time to play the OJ Trivia Feud! Let me bring on my assistant for this game. Please step on up, sir. Our first category, please, sir, if you will. OJ's alibi. What was he doing with Cato? He was uh, going uh, to do the alarm and he went to McDonald's. To go went to McDonald's, that's true. He was eating with Cato Kalen. Number four, please. Eating with Cato. Yes, I think they both had Big Macs. Is yeah, that right? they did. All Drive right. through. And he loaned Cato the money. All right, that's please. <laughs> Did they have it with special sauce or without? Our next category coming up is evidence against OJ. DNA! And what does DNA stand for? DNA, I don't know, let's go. DNA! Don't worry, the jury didn't understand it either. <laughs> All right, men, heads down. Heads down. Keep it low. Keep it low in formation. All right, everybody accounted for. Step up here, soldier. Hey, Sergeant Dick Bay here, with a ragtag platoon of guerrilla fighters. You see, all these men have wimped out. Their dictator wives have them in control and disciplined. They, you all right, soldier? I just can't take it anymore. My wife tells me what to do, I just can't take it anymore. Snap out of it! Don't worry, son. It's gonna be all right. I know your wife tells you what to wear. She tells you where you can go. I know she takes your paycheck every week and spends the money any way she likes. I know she tells you what friends you can have. I know she's been ordering you to clean up the house, but all that's gonna change. A revolution's coming, and those dictator wives will be overthrown by this ragtag group of guerrilla fighters. Wimpy husbands and dictator wives join the revolution next on the Richard Bay Show. This is terrible. This is the one of the worst catastrophes in the world. We have an East Coast versus West Coast bikini contest, and you're invited to the beach party. <laughs> All right, East Coast, West Coast questions. What is the northernmost state on the West Coast? <laughs> There's only one way to find out the truth, and that's to hear... The Voice of Truth. The Voice of Truth. The Voice of Truth. And the key question here is, she wanted to know if he loves her, and he does not love her. How about the young lady he was leaning up against on the street? <laughs> she wanted to know if he had sex with a girl named Tiki, and he did. You're busted. And she wanted to know... You. But the worst cheater here, oh. the man with the most blatant lies and the weakest excuses, was Blas. And he is now on the wheel of torture! Can we give that wheel a spin? While his wronged lady, Dawn, Gets to exact her revenge. Dawn, throw the beans, not yourself. We believe in justice here on The Richard Bay Show, and that's why we have created a jury of their peers. <laughs> Accused of one count of cheating, one count of lying, several counts of unfaithfulness. I'm innocent. Ellie!
with the largest cellulite thighs, thunder thighs, compete in the second annual Gargantu Games on the Richard Bay Show. Next. Our next guests are all guys with large bellies. They were in belly flopping contest when they jumped in the whole pool water flew right out. Here they are today to compete for the title of Mr. Gargantu Gut. You have got to feed her the Twinkies. For every one you eat, I will give you $10. Go, I see four Twinkies. All right, you have got forty dollars. You want to take that with you? Because you're going to Bay's Cafe. You watch Bay. You're going to see men with miniature musculature. You're going to see guys who couldn't even buy a bicep, who've never tried a tricep. You're going to see guys here today who are so wimpy that they can win the title of Mr. Universe. Criminals set free. Fancy, fast-talking lawyers. Absurd sentences. Across this country, citizens have lost faith in a once great legal system. Where can Americans turn now for justice? The answer, Judge Bay and his court of last appeal. Next on The Richard Bay Show. America, he's your last chance. I'll give you $50 for what's in that box. I'll give you $50 for what's in that box. You want to trade? Trade it. Trade it for $50? $50. Okay. I got $50 for you. We'll be giving you $50. And you passed up this. You didn't want it. And you sold it for $50. And what you gave up was... A three-day cruise to the Bahamas! A cruise vacation of a lifetime! Courtesy of Travel Opportunities Unlimited, a three-day cruise! Everywhere I go, it's the Richard Bay Show. People know the games we're playing. Get up high in the face, run a stupid race. Say Bay's phrase and I'm paying. There will come a day, there won't be any Dick Bay. Don't worry about Dick. When the end comes, I know you'll be watching this show. Late at night on Nick, cause I'm Some little mama, turn off your V-chip and take a chance on me. I'm not so bad. Bop, bop, bop. But now that Congress is cutting the funding for PBS, the Richard Bay Show is the only place to find intelligent broadcasting on TV. Yeah.